It is free comic book day. I am still in bed, but I intend to get up and go meet Jenny at the store to get some free stuff and buy some stuff as well. I got up and I got dressed and now I'm in the car heading to Dr. Volt's. I have arrived. I have my chai tea and there's a big old line which makes me so happy. I love when people come out for stuff like this. Still in line, but look! Jenny's here! No. <laughs> she didn't know that was gonna happen. <laughs> Phase one complete. And now a review. This one I didn't really like uh, at all. <laughs> uh, this one I love the art. The story was a little bit boring. This I just grabbed because I love Lumberjanes. If you haven't read Lumberjanes, you're missing out big time. This was one of the better options. It has really simple art and the story was really simple and cute. Uh, it's very enjoyable. I really, really like Moon Cop. Uh, this one is great as well. It's all about the civil rights movement, and um, it's a cool format to put history in, and John Lewis is the greatest. This was easily my favorite of the free comic book day options. I had never really read Archie before because I thought the art was ugly. <laughs> now it's right up my alley, and he got all hot, and uh, luckily my neighbor agreed as a big Archie fan that this run is fantastic and he subscribed so now he gets the new issues and I get to read them. Yay! And of course while I have you here I want to show you what I got that was not free. The new issue of Paper Girls. This comic is straight up nuts. I still don't really get what's going on <laughs> but it's so great. I got the uh, standalone Birds of Prey book um, that Gail Simone did and it's gorgeous and Oof, everything you want. This is like one of the first DC books that I've ever bought. I got the first issue of Alias at the recommendation of Rebecca, uh, and it's really good. I like the show better, I think, but I think that might be because I saw it first. And then, of course, um, this, which is my favorite thing that has ever been created. If you haven't read The Wicked and the Divine, or you don't know about The Wicked and the Divine, Please ask me, because I could go on for days, and I don't want to force you to sit here and listen to it, but basically, it's the greatest thing that's ever happened, and it has art like this. Oh my gosh. So, uh, 